Okay, so as you know, Kim and I are responding to over 80 of you who have responded to a survey on what are the biggest things that you you wrestle with as a coffee shop or craft brewery owner. And one of those was, how can I enhance the satisfaction of my employees? Now, because of the pandemic and this crazy hiring world that we're in right now, it's hard enough to find good workers. But when you find them, retention is so thinking important. You need to make them feel like they are a part of the family, part where where they where they feel appreciated. I mean, the worst thing that a coffee shop owner can do is treat their employees like commodities. Uh, you know, first of all, you have a lot of turnover. But what happens is customers come to connect with certain baristas or certain、um, employees, and when they leave, that has a ripple effect with、uh, with the customer. So, how do we engage and create more satisfaction among our employees? Kim, what are a couple of thoughts that you might have? Yeah. So, what I've seen work in terms of experience that I with other working with. The coffee shop owners and craft brewers is、um, under awesome communication, right? So, in terms of improving and enhancing your your employee satisfaction, is com- is communicating with them, making so it's and it starts from the day that they come on board as an employee and understanding why they're there, right?、Um, when you're looking at hiring a, a cl-、uh, an employee, like. Do they even drink coffee, right? <laughs> like, do, do they even are they even vested in the experience of coffee? And、um, and if they're not, well, maybe they're not a good fit, right? So it starts with making sure that you're hiring the employee that's going to best represent your coffee shop and in your values and your mission on a daily basis. And so and then from there, then being able to communicate with them. Working with them on the onboarding process to make sure that they feel comfortable with the training that they're receiving. Right? It's、um, bringing somebody on and then just throwing them to the wolves. Like, okay, go do it. Right? Like, I feel like we all need a little bit of onboarding and a little bit of education, especially in a new environment when you're working with a new employer.、Um, and again, it's a small business. There aren't that many employees at a coffee shop, right? So if it's like. There's five to fifteen total employees at any given time. There's probably only three or four people actually working in the coffee shop. So you want to make sure there's good communication going amongst all those employees that are working together. And what that may require as the business owner is for you to spend time at the coffee shop doing on. Premises training, live training, to make sure that 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 everybody is working together in the way that you imagine that your coffee shop would be run. So again, just I feel that the idea of enhancing the employee satisfaction is communicating, giving the employees an opportunity to talk to you, being accessible, and also ke- promoting the communication amongst the employees together.、Um, are you seeing any? Um, additional employee satisfaction, like、uh, in terms of events that that coffee shops do to promote、uh, teamwork within and in satisfaction with their employees, Scott. Oh no, I lost you. <laughs> All right, well I'm going to keep going. <laughs> Hopefully, Scott will come back.、Um, Yeah, and then、uh, the other idea would be to take an opportunity to have a team meeting, to have team training, to then discuss. Um, again, what are the goals? What are the drink specials that are coming up? Engaging the what Scott was saying earlier when we were talking about、uh, on an earlier video when we we're talking about expanding what I offer my clients. Oh, there's the puppy. <laughs> Sophie's working.、Um, being able to pull in the baristas so that they're contributing to the drinks, to the drinks that are being created. So they now have a vested. Um, connection to your coffee shop because they are contributing, right? So make them feel part of the team, make them bring them into the、uh, the discussion and the creation of your offers, right? And and really trying to include them as much as possible, 
So, right, like you're ultimately the business owner and you want them to feel like this is their, you know, their company, that they are um, a vital part to the success of what you're trying to achieve with your clients. And um, and that will definitely assist your, the discussion that you're having with your employees on you know, how they're working together and feeling included in the, um, the business uh, on a daily basis. Hi, Scott, we lost you for a little bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I lost my internet connection. Welcome back. Um, so we're still talking about enhancing employee satisfaction, right? Yeah, exactly. Okay. And I was just talking about, you know, again, communication, teamwork, team events, having a team meeting, and uh, also having employees contributing to the offer. So it's so in, um, in one of our prior videos, we talked about expanding the, the offer that we provide to clients and bringing the employee into that conversation. So the employee is doing the creating, not always just you as the business owner. That, that's exactly right because what because we get engaged in things that we had a part of right there we're going to put a link to this particular video um to a, an article from perfect daily grind which is a great one of the great resources and the title is planning for a positive work culture in your coffee shop i mean i know it's not for craft breweries but you can probably there's a lot of overlap there it's great great um, stuff in that article i won't go into it now but but i know that you took care of the, the content while i was gone <laughs> no absolutely <laughs> all right